What's going on everybody? It is your man Cleveland Terry and this request has been showing up in my messages for like a couple of weeks now and that is what table do you use when you are DJing? Now I have been using for the past two years one table because I use controllers this table is absolutely perfect it works in any situation and that's why I love it and that is the fast set table by fast set. So the reason I love this table is it's just like your normal X stand type thing. If you're a musician or if you used to have a coffin, there are latches on the side that make for an easy release and your table's ready to go. The table itself, it's, um, it's, a, it's, a, it's a hard plastic. There's no wood, it's all plastic and metal and uh, very, very stable. It's a very stable table. This is what I love about it. When the latches click into place, they don't move. Now, this is the highest it can go, which is about three feet, but it can also drop down, and this is two feet. So this is basically if you were sitting down on a chair. I don't know if anybody would ever have a reason to use a table this low, but you do have that option. The table itself is 42 inches long and 18 inches deep. Why do I love this table? Well, because everything that they designed for this table is designed to be used in conjunction with this table. So a lot of people might use their own stands. You don't need to do that with this table. This table has stands designed for it. So I'm gonna show you what they look like. Just like your standard computer table, same situation here, it does flip out like any table, locks into place. You have these latching mechanisms that allow you to adjust a little higher, a little lower, and then you have this clamp, and this clamp is the bread and butter of this table. This clamp is designed to latch on to the table. Now, what's really, really cool about this is there are multiple latch points on the table. So say, for instance, on this side, you can go to about there all this area right here. And then you, get, you hit a roadblock. You lift it up, reclamp it, and you can go all the way over here, and then so on and so forth. So basically, you can have multiple stands on here. And if you saw my video, the last Instagram video that I posted, so I had everything I needed already set up. Once the clamp is in, you just take this guy right here, and you just feed him in, like so. Once it locks into place, there's a little latch on the bottom that you tighten up and it's not going anywhere. You still can move it, but it's not gonna be pulled out. Great, great stand. So that's just one thing. Now, if I'm just DJing normally, this is all I would take. Maybe three of these and then the table. Uh, let's just get cost out of the way before we go into anything else because I know you people are gonna be wondering what it costs. It's not cheap but it's not overly expensive. The table itself is 220. The stands are, I believe, like 130, but if you buy them in their bundles, and they have three different bundles. One bundle is what they call their pro bundle, and it gives you the table and the stand, and I believe it's 320. And then they have a, like a master bundle, which gives you this table, and then three of these stands, and I think it's like 470. Also, if you were a musician, uh, they have a musician stand. So a lot of different options for this table. Now, the last thing I do want to talk about is they've made their own scrims. And I honestly really, really love these scrims. And trust me when I tell you, I'm not a scrim guy. I'm, I'm really not. But this one is super cool. So I just want to show you the bag real quick because I bought two different color scrims. I bought a black one and I bought a white one. The bags are the same, so I'm looking through as I'm going through my bag, like how do I know which one's the white one? Well, because they thought about that and they actually gave you a little white tag to show you that this is the white one. So I know that the white scrim is in here. The black scrim is in the one with the black tag. All right, let's show you a little bit how this thing works. On this scrim, standard scrim like anything else, nothing special, but except for this top part. And this top part has zippers and all of these zippers this is your bread and butter here this is what's going to make this thing look super super clean so let's show you what it looks like all right let's try it this way there we go 
Okay. Uh, there's a very specific way to put this on the table and you have to follow the little, the little uh, corners that will lock on to the other corners like so. And then once you have kind of your initial, your initial settings, uh, you can then take the feet like so, and the feet also have uh, a little bit of a elastic and then it has another piece right here, right on top like so. And then the other side, okay, there you go. So when your table's done, it looks like this, super clean. And then on the other side, you have space and ability to put your cables and your plugs and your adapters all underneath, but nobody sees it on the other side. So it keeps it nice and clean for you, but then you can still get in here and do what you need to do. So I do like this. I don't use this one too often, but in a pinch, uh, it's amazing. Now, the best part of this are the zippers. So let's go back to this guy and show you what I'm talking about. All of these zippers are designed to go to a certain part and then stop because FastSet wants you to be able to kind of use it how you see fit. And if you like your cords to go through here or here or here, you can do that. So I'm gonna open this up like so. I'm gonna move this guy over a little bit. There you go. So once I get that, I can take my clamp and then feed it right in here like so. And then I can put my table, my stand, like so. Okay, now once it's locked into place, once it's locked into place, I can then pull the scrim over it, take the zipper, and then zip it up. On the stand, there are these little latches that allow you to put your cords, for instance, your USB cord, your computer power cord can run through here and then feed it all the way in here and then close it up. So it's super clean. Nobody sees anything, nobody sees any cords. Love it, absolutely love it. This is a great, great table. There's really nothing more for me to say. It's a great table, I use it, I've been using it for the past two years and the only thing that I have lost is occasionally a foot, the little rubber feet. If you've used an X-Stand, you know what I'm talking about. The little rubber feet will slide off and then I'll have to put it back on. But that's the only thing that has happened. Everything else about this table has been rock solid. Um, it's made in America, if you're into that kind of thing. And um, the quality is second to none. So yes, it may be more expensive than like your Odyssey tables or anything like that. You know, those kind of wood particle board tables that are carpeted. But I will tell you, I have yet to find a wood table with the feet that go like that, uh, that hasn't either loosened up over time or just kind of come loose. And I've watched my table start to fall down. I've actually had twice in my life, the actual table literally fold in and I watched my DJ equipment just slide off. Uh, I'd like to avoid that in the future. So this table, I know it's not gonna break down. And even if it, for instance, decided to come loose, um, there's too many, there's too many spots for it to kind of lock it into place. So I'm not really worried about that. It's a, it's a great table. So fast set, I will leave the website in the description below. And then you can also get these things at uh, multiple DJ websites out there. But um, fast set, it's great stuff. Great, great stuff. All right guys, if you found what I said here useful, hit that like button. If you found what I said here really useful, hit that subscribe button. Make sure you follow me on the Instagrams and the Twitters. Get on my Discord, because that's where we're talking about all things Cleveland Terry. Guys, girls, always a pleasure. If I don't talk to you later, we'll talk soon. Peace. If you're wondering where I'm at, uh, this was my daughter's room. Uh, when she, she graduated college, and then she's uh, a working girl and she's on her own in her own apartment. So this room is empty. Haven't figured out what we're gonna do with this room yet, but I can tell you it's not treated. As you can hear all the echoes and the room, I never painted this room because it was, it was always kind of the spare bedroom. So um, we might turn it into a workout room or a dance studio. Haven't figured that out just yet. I can't take any more rooms or my family's going to kill me. I've taken enough rooms. <laughs> Peace.